Every week we meet people who get steamed up about their hobbies, but uh, the contender this week for top collector gets steamed up about steam, and it's James Huntley. James, how long have you been a collector? Many years, I think. Yeah, about six years, yeah. Six how old years. are you now? Ten. So you started when you were four? Yeah. Wow. And what got you started? Um, I went to steam rally with my granddad and my mum, and they said if I see a steam model steam engine around, um, we'll buy it for you. So they bought it for me, and it just started from then. And what was the, that one? What was the first uh, one you ever got? It was a Mammod stationary steam engine. A Mammod's a famous maker. Yeah, British one. And this is just part of your collection This is now. just part of the collection. It's about 50 in total. Wow. And what do you pay? Do you haggle about the money? I do haggle quite a lot, yeah. What's the most you've ever paid for an engine? I think it must have been that one there. Yeah. The, uh, Mercer engine. What did you pay? Um, I think it was £368. Wow. But it's um, gone up to about £400 now. So a good investment. It's a good, yeah. What is it that turns you on about steam? What do you really like um, about it? I'm not really sure. I just, got an, I just like them, really. Is it the smell? I do like the smell. The smell is nice. And um, I just like them, basically. <laughs> yeah. Yes, fair yeah. enough. So, what happens with the the old ones that are a bit of a wreck? I mean, this one... That one, um, I was given along with this one here, the roller, at a steam rally about two months ago. We're not going to... We're going to... Might put the wheels back on, but we're not sure, because it catches people's interest when you've got an engine that's fallen to pieces. And, but, but you, it, you it, do rebuild them, do we you? Do, we would, yeah. But that one does run, actually. You put airline on it and then he would start off and he shouldn't run, but he does. So you could put all these things together if they went wrong, could you? Well, yeah, I built my own one Did and you? it's over there, so over there. Little tiny one about that big. It was all your own work? Yeah, I bought it as a kit, part machine, and then I used the lathe and the drill to build it. And are, you, are you always on the lookout for new ones? Yeah, yeah. But I prefer looking at the odd and prefer finding the odd and unusual ones that you won't find another one like. And, and you've got a mate who helps you around as well, don't you? Yeah. Who's that? Uh, my brother. He's around here somewhere. I don't know where he is. And is he as keen as you are? No. But he's not interested in really. He's interested in killing people. And... Killing people? Yeah. But he just likes watching programmes about killing people. Oh. And all you care about is? Steam engines, really. 